What are the most expensive things in the world? Indeed, artworks. Year by year, the secondary art market shocks the world, with dazzling sales at auction. Very often, these auction records result in either huge excitement, or major public controversy. But what are the highest realized prices for contemporary art? This means we won't be presenting Salvatore Mundi by Leonardo da Vinci, Paul Cezanne's card players, or Paul Gauguin's When Will You Marry? Only recent, post-war and contemporary artworks, are taken into account. Here come the most expensive contemporary artworks in the world. Number 10, Flag from 1958 by Jasper Johns, sold for $110 million. We open our list with Jasper Johns. Born in 1930 in Augusta, Georgia, the American artist is best known for his flag paintings. As a result, it is no surprise a flag painting, from 1958, is his most expensive painting up to date. In March 2010, Jean Christophe Castelli sold the artwork in question by manner of a private sale to Stephen Cohen for an impressive US$110 million. United States. The American artist, associated with abstract expressionism but also pop art, has been the most expensive living artist multiple times throughout his career, achieving seven- and eight-figure auction results on an almost regular basis. Jasper Johns is also included in our video on the most famous contemporary painters today. Number 9, Untitled from 1982 by Jean-Michel Basquiat, sold for $110.5 million. Arguably, the most famous untitled painting in the world, the artwork was sold by the Basquiat's family on May 18, 2017, at Sotheby's in New York. Yusaku Maezawa bid $110.5 million, United States dollars, making the artwork the most expensive artwork by an American artist. Jean-Michel Basquiat, born in 1960 and passed away in 1988 in New York City, was an American artist and pioneer of the neo-expressionist art movement. Basquiat would rise to fame, becoming the American golden boy, achieving monumental successes during his early 20s, participating in major art events around the world, before his untimely death aged just 27. Number 8, Woman 3 from 1953 by Willem de Kooning, sold for $137.5 million. November 18, 2006. Larry Gagosian completes the private sale, from David Geffen's collection to Stephen Cohen. The painting in question is an expressionist painting by Willem de Kooning from his Woman series. The realized price, $137.5 million United States dollars. The painting itself is a typical oil-on-canvas expressionist painting, characteristic for de Kooning's oeuvre. Willem de Kooning, born in 1904 in Rotterdam, the Netherlands, was a Dutch-American painter who passed away in 1997, in East Hampton, New York. However, this painting is not de Kooning's most expensive painting by a distance. So, stay tuned. Number 7, Number 5 from 1948 by Jackson Pollock, sold for $140 million. Our number 7 of this list is the painting Number 5, from 1948, by the one and only Jackson Pollock. As with our top 4, Jackson Pollock's drip paintings are in fact not really contemporary art. Action painting and abstract expressionism can be considered as the culmination point of modern art, as we are balancing on the transition of modern to postmodern art. Nevertheless, this post-war painting is as iconic as its master. Jackson Pollock, born in 1912 in Cody, Wyoming, passed away aged 44 in Springs, New York. On November 2 in 2006, the painting was sold for an incredible $140 million US dollars, by manner of a private sale arranged by Sotheby's. Doing so, the monumental masterpiece became the most expensive painting in the world, before being surpassed in April 2011. Number 6, Three Studies of Lucian Freud from 1969 by Francis Bacon, sold for $142.4 million. A portrait by one master of the other. Three Studies of Lucian Freud was painted in 1969 by Francis Bacon. The British artist, born in 1909 and passed away in 1992, depicted his dear friend and colleague Lucian Freud in this unique triptych. In November 12, 2013, Elaine Wynne bought the masterpiece at Christie's in New York, 
for a stunning 142.4 million United States dollars. Doing so, the British figurative painter dethroned everyone, taking the record of the most expensive artwork sold at auction. The record would stand until May 2015, as Bacon was surpassed by the number 4 from our list. Number 5, Masterpiece from 1962 by Roy Lichtenstein, sold for $165 million. In fifth spot, we encounter the highest ranked, most expensive, true contemporary artwork. Masterpiece from 1962 by Roy Lichtenstein, was sold in 2017 by manner of a private sale, for a total of $165 million United States dollars. Steve Cohen bought the iconic artwork from Agnes Gund, with the sale being used as a starting point to fund the criminal justice reform, which was called the Art for Justice Fund. Roy Lichtenstein, born in 1923 and passed away in 1997 in New York City, was an American pop artist. He pioneered the contemporary art movement along the likes of Andy Warhol or Jasper Johns. The artwork in question was featured in his retrospectives across the globe in the years before the sale, indicating a strategic timing for the artwork to go on sale. Number 4, La Femme d'Algier, version O, from 1955 by Pablo Picasso, sold for $179.4 million. Although it is clear to say Pablo Picasso is not really a contemporary artist, as his works and relevance are rooted in modern art and the interwar era, the iconic Spanish-French artist continued to produce new works, into the post-war era. As a result, we encounter one of his works in our list, taking the fourth spot in our article, with La Femme d'Algier, version O, from 1955. Pablo Picasso, born in 1881 in Malaga, Spain, was a modern artist and pioneer of Cubism, who passed away in 1973 in Mougin, France. The artwork in question went from a private collection onto the secondary market, resulting in a memorable sale at Christie's in New York. A Qatari politician bought the artwork for a staggering 179.4 million US dollars. Number 3, Number 6, Violet, Green and Red, from 1951 by Mark Rothko, sold for $186 million. We enter the podium with none other than Mark Rothko. In August 2014, Yves Bouvier sold the painting Number 6, Violet, Green and Red, from 1951 by manner of a private sale to Dmitry Rybolovlev, for a total of $186 million United States dollars. At the time, the realized price made the painting in question the most expensive artwork in the world. Mark Rothko is a Latvian-American painter, born in 1903 in Daugavpils, Latvia, who passed away in 1970 in New York City. Mark Rothko is one of the most important abstract expressionists, best known for his color field paintings from the 1950s and 1960s. In fact, it is no surprise to find Mark Rothko in the top three of our list, as his works are often sold for seven and eight figures on the secondary market. Number 2, Number 17A from 1948 by Jackson Pollock, sold for $200 million. In second spot, we encounter another Jackson Pollock painting. This time, the famous abstract expressionist shocked the world with a whopping $200 million for the painting Number 17A from 1948. The painting had been sold through a private sale from the David Geffen Foundation to Kenneth C. Griffin. The painting in question featured in the edition of Life, the magazine issue that would make Pollock not only an artist, but also a celebrity. The value of the painting in 1948 was rather low due to the underwhelming first reactions. However, as Pollock became a truly established artist in the years shortly after, the mocking turned into applause and the low value would reach incredible heights culminating in this massive sale in 2015, resulting in a second spot in this video. Number 1, Interchange from 1955 by Willem de Kooning, sold for $300 million. The most expensive contemporary artwork in the world, is the painting titled Interchange, from 1955, by Willem de Kooning. In September of 2015, the David Geffen Foundation sold the painting by manner of a private sale, to the entrepreneur and investor Kenneth C. Griffin, for a mind-boggling $300 million United States dollars. As you might have spotted, on the same day, Kenneth C. Griffin also bought our silver medalist of this list, spending $500 million United States dollars on just two paintings the same day. 
Although the painting seems to be pure abstraction, the pinkish paint represents a seated woman in the center of the canvas. The artist finished the artwork in 1955, before selling it for US$4,000 during the same year. Sixty years later, the painting was sold for 75,000 times more, becoming temporarily the most expensive artwork in the world. Today, only Leonardo da Vinci's Salvatore Mundi surpasses de Kooning's artwork, albeit by a distance of $150 million. These were the top 10 most expensive contemporary artworks in the world. Thank you for watching, see you soon.